All right, it's time for another basic ass reaction. And today, I'm late to this. This video actually came out like two weeks ago and I kept telling you guys I was gonna film it on my own time and do a, a big reaction, but prepping for this Electric Cowboy Tour, man, I have no time for anything. So today we're gonna do it live on Twitch. It'll be on YouTube later. We are checking out the latest music video from Orbit Culture, one of my personal favorite modern metal bands. Saw these guys live a couple months ago and they just absolutely crushed it, dude. They're so good. I can't remember if they played this live to be 100% honest. I know they played a new song, but I can't remember if it was this one. You guys know how it is live. Like maybe I'll remember some of this if this was the song they played, but um, I'm not sure. But anyways, if you're not familiar with Orbit Culture, again, one of my favorite new newer metal bands that's kind of blown up right now. And with this song, they have also announced their brand new studio album. Unfortunately, nobody from their label thought about putting that information in the description of this fucking video, which I find wild. It's not just them either. We've seen other labels release stuff and there's no information about the new album or pre-order links or anything. Mind blowing to me. So I had to look it up somewhere else, but their brand new album Descent will be out everywhere on August 18th, 2023 from Seek and Strike Records. If you're watching this on YouTube later, I'll make sure to have links where you can go pre-order that and check out their socials and keep up with what they're doing. But I'm stoked to see this. It's uh, a little over six minutes of a video. So uh, what do you say we just get into this one? Oh, that's cool. I, I don't remember this from when I saw him live and I feel like I would have, but also you know how those rooms get, they're like super loud. So maybe you didn't notice that, but the heaviness of that riff mixed with that clean tone back there is so rad. They didn't play this live, it was alienated. Okay, thank you. I saw somebody else say alienated earlier too and I wasn't sure. So I have never heard this song then. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> This intro is sick. Sorry, I want to hear a little bit of that again because I can't tell if that's them just doing muted strings or if that's like a... Uh, like a delay effect on the guitar, but that's really cool. Looks like they're all playing their new ESPs too. That is so sick. God, dude. I got to really hand it to, I believe unless things have changed that like Nicholas still does most of the recording and programming and writing for all of their music. He's such a, an underrated musical mind when it comes to metal because there's so much stuff in their songs that are like thrown in as additional elements that are just so rad, dude. 
This actually feels like it could have fit on the Shaman EP as well. What do you want to bet this is a Rivata video? <laughs> Ooh. Sneaky little piano. God, those kicks are hammering, dude. <laughs> An excellent pickup. I like that little lead work back there too. Kind of wish it was a little louder in the mix. Six minutes already? Nah. Oh my god, dude. Let's invade France. I like how they ended on that with the vocals there. That was really cool. Dude, you know, I'm never disappointed with anything this band puts out, ever. Like, I think the first time I ever filmed a reaction to them, Saw, and maybe even the next time, I was like, everything that they put out feels like this was a band that was tailored to my tastes and what I like in metal, and they wrote stuff specifically for me. That's how I feel about this band. Production-wise, it's everything we expect from how it should sound with Orbit Culture. Tones are incredible. The mix is really good on everything, and I love the additional elements that are in there with some of the effects and stuff. You had piano parts. You had, like, kind of, like, that horn part in the background and certain stuff. Um, video was super cool, too. I really liked the visuals of the video, Here's a, not, here's a statement that might seem a little odd. Don't know if I would have released this as a single. Like, I love the song. Absolutely love the song. There's nothing wrong with it. But if I'm at a record label, I don't know if that's the song that I would have picked for, like, a, a single for an album. But that's just me. Six minutes is pretty long for a single, um, especially, 
you got to assume every single you release as a band is going to pull in more viewers. That's why I repeat myself a lot in YouTube videos. A lot of people get annoyed by that, but I assume that every time I release a video, there are going to be first time watchers. That's what you got to assume like this. Yeah, that is a good point. They did release Vultures in North last year. That's, that is a great point. So yeah, now that you bring that up, that's, that, that's a great point leading into the album. Vultures in North was that more in your face, just crazy, you know, shorter song. This is more of your epic. Like this actually does, like I said, this feels like it could have been on Shaman, on the Shaman EP. Like it had that kind of vibe to it. It had that long kind of adventure to it as well. I think the release itself is great. Again, I still stand by, I don't know if this specifically would have been what I would have released if I were working at a label, but I haven't heard anything else. So I don't know what the options were. But anyways, 10 out of 10 for me, dude. I love this band. I love everything they're doing. Um, I'm excited to see what this album does and what they do in the future. And who knows, maybe I'll have them back in my house for another barbecue again. One of these days, <laughs> there's a video on that. If you guys haven't seen that, but, uh, just as a reminder to everybody that's watching right now, their brand new album descent is going to release on August 18th. That's less than a month from now, August 18th, 2023. I will put pre-order links in the description of this video. A great way to support bands. Pre-order the albums. It bumps their record placements, stuff like that. But thank you guys very much for watching. If this is your first time here, feel free to click subscribe. Give the video a like. Help it out. Leave a comment, even if it's nonsense, because that all, help, all, that all helps the algorithm. Thank you for everybody on Twitch for being here live and watching. Wherever you are in the world, be safe. Be kind to each other. I love you all. And I'll be back very soon with another basic-ass reaction.